Today I'm going to give you one of the most epic property tours you will ever see in New York City. Maybe even the world. But first, before we go inside, because it's 11,000 square feet, it's going to take us a hot minute, you need to know where we are. We are where West Chelsea meets Meatpacking. Probably one of the coolest areas to be, especially to own a home. Right behind me is the Dream Hotel. And right over there is Catch Steak, just opened. And then right down there at the end of the block, you've got a new Six Senses Hotel and Spa with the 11 condominiums on top selling for unbelievable amounts of money. And then right here is 357 West 17th Street. And wait one second. Because Yuri, my driver, drove me here. Where? Hello? Yuri? I feel like I like lost my driver. Hold on. Oh, man. Ben, do you fit in this car? Uh, yeah, a little small, but still Ferrari. Yeah, it's Look still a Ferrari. Ferrari okay, great. That's great. All right, I don't want to tell the owner that you're in his Ferrari right now. I thought you were just going for a walk. All right, so while Yuri takes care of the car, let's get this property tour started. <laughs> Sorry, Yuri can be a little bit crazy and listen, he gets excited by Ferraris, what can I say? Um, but now you know that this house, one comes with its own private garage space with curb cut out onto the streets into meatpacking in Chelsea, which is crazy. These ceilings are over 13 feet. Look how small I look right now. Do I look small? I know. This is just in the entry foyer. Oh, hi, Ferrari. Marble floors everywhere, everything custom, everything imported. All the door handles are done by Swarovski. And you've got this great interior feeling from Andre Escobar, who designed the whole house. If you know anything about me, if you've watched any of my videos, YouTube, Unlocked on Facebook, seen any of my shows on Bravo, anywhere you know, that I like TV and I love being on screen. So why not have your own private movie theater? Yep. This is off the first floor, off the gallery space, your own private big screen movie theater. I mean, this thing is just wild. Like I, I would not work. If I owned this house, I would come in here and just watch movies all day. Or I'd watch Million Dollar List in New York. Or I'd put on my YouTube channel which you should make sure you subscribe to and hit that little button, make sure you hit the bell, okay? So make sure you do that. And I would watch that right here on this huge screen. That would be nuts, totally crazy. There's even a popcorn machine. All right, so now we've just seen the beginning of the house. This is the first floor. Let's go upstairs. Welcome to the second floor. Now, before I show you the living room, just take a look at this crazy powder room. Look at this. There's bathrooms on every floor, by the way on the master bedroom suite floor. There's three toilets. We're gonna get to that later. But look at this sink. I mean, like, who does this? This is just crazy. You get the thing over here, look at that. Isn't that crazy? Like, who thinks of this? This is the showpiece of all showpieces for your powder room on your living room floor. Right off the powder room is your 26 foot by 23 foot living room. Ceilings are over 13 feet, Venetian plaster on the ceiling, hi-hats, built-in speakers, full security system like we talked about, huge, huge floor-to-ceiling windows looking out over West 17th Street, super quiet. The house is built like a fortress. You've got this massive Venetian plaster enclosed fireplace. Look at this mantle. Look how crazy this is. Imagine having your big screen curved TV here because obviously for you, you're just not okay with just having the movie theater downstairs. And then you've got this Da Vinci custom gas fireplace. Just look at this for one second. I'm gonna show you one thing. Hold on, hold on. Oh, it's changing colors. Oh, it's changing colors. Oh, oh yes. So that's the main living room, the formal living space. And now I'm gonna show you the most insane kitchen you've ever seen in New York City. Two islands, almost 30 foot ceilings, St. Laurent marble countertops, Swarovski crystal everywhere. Look at this. These are Swarovski crystal handles. You even have them 
in all of the different millwork here. Look at this. See this? Nobody does this. You've got wine coolers, refrigerators on top of freezers, on top of refrigerators, on top of freezers. Look at this animal skin. Look how beautiful this is. Stretch out over the cabinetry. All the different cutlery spaces are already set up for you. Tons and tons and tons of storage space. And look at these stars. I mean, literally, you can have breakfast here under the stars every day. And if you want a little outdoor space for your morning cup of coffee, you've got this massive backyard ready to go. Talk about indoor outdoor living. Huge outdoor dining room, surrounded by greenery, outdoor kitchen, refrigerator, and outdoor grill. Now, if you think this is crazy, let me show you the dining room. Now we're on the third floor for the formal dining room. Now, if you remember from the kitchen that we just saw, you've got that crazy starlight chandelier hanging down over the dining space below. You've got your formal dining room up here. I mean, just look at this view. This is just so crazy to me. Let me just remind you of this. No one in their right mind would build a townhouse like this. To have this double height, to have this chandelier, to have all of this glass, these floors, the crystals, the details. I mean, even the detail just in the HVAC system is out of this world. Look how fun this detail is. Oh, you wanna do some hors d'oeuvres? Maybe put out some drinks here on your butcher block countertop? No problem. Oh, but then you need your sink? Oh, where's the sink? Where's it? Oh. There's the sink. Come take a look at this. Boom, sink, right here. Sink, what's up? What's up, sink? Nice to see you. Hope it's been okay in there. Details. Mm -hmm. On this floor, you also have two guest bedrooms. You can use them for offices, for dens, for staff. I love all the bedrooms because they're huge. All the bedrooms are also en suite with bathrooms. Take a look. Gorgeous marble. I mean, literally. Even the bathrooms for the guests at the lowest level of this house are out of control. We're about to go to the master floor. Lady Gaga actually stayed in the house once. She was the only person to ever actually stay in this house, and you're gonna see why. Welcome to your master suite. The master suite takes up the entire fourth floor, and it has both his and her bathrooms, plus an additional powder room for three toilets on the floor, plus two sitting rooms, plus extra custom closet space that is just completely insane. In between the master bedroom and the master bathroom, you get this whole wall of custom cabinetry with a leather trim, and it takes you right to your second sitting room. This can totally be built out for even more custom closet space, and then, this is a master bathroom, unlike any master bathroom you've ever seen. Just think about the most insane master bathroom you've ever seen in your whole life. This is about to blow your mind. Here we go. As you enter, you're hit by your mosaic tile art wall. Two toilets on either side, each with their own glass doorway. Look at this master bathroom shower. I've got the oversized rain shower head, and I've got one, two, three, four, five, six power jets. Plus I've got the hand shower to sing in because this is 357 West 17th Street, the most insane 11,000 square foot townhouse you've ever seen. Good, you like that? Wait until you see the bathtub. Two separate sinks, and then you've got the most insane tub ever. I mean, wow. Wow, let's get in it. I mean, Lady Gaga was in this tub. I, I like, dude, how did they even get this in here? Like, I could totally just, like, look at this. This is the coolest tub I've ever seen. Go on the staircase. I wanna show you something pretty wild about this elevator. Yeah, forgot to mention, this elevator has a glass wall so you can see everything as you go through. Yeah, this is pretty cool. Come on, chop chop, we gotta go to the roof, let's go. Oh hey, lucky to find you here. How incredible is this? This is your private roof deck. The house comes with over 2,000 square feet of private outdoor space with these amazing, amazing views in one of the coolest locations. This isn't the West Village, that's quiet, it's not uptown, this isn't Brooklyn. This is where meatpacking meets Chelsea. 
This is where everybody wants to be. And if you get this house, you have 11,000 square feet over six floors with your own private garage for your Ferraris. I mean, come on. Now let's go downstairs. I need you to go to your room and put on a bathing suit because what I'm about to show you is wet and wild. Wow. Independently temperature controlled wine cellar with security system. This is where you've got all the mechanicals, all the storage, powder room. You've got your own private gym, your own yoga room. And then you've got your own pool and sauna. I mean, what is this? you got a working pool. Behind you, you've got your own dry sauna so you can sweat it out, give yourself a little swim. This is a smart pool, so it's got a wave propelling system to it, so you can actually swim against a current for an amazing workout. And then you can go stretch in your private yoga room. So that's it. That is 357 West 17th Street, a townhouse in New York City unlike any other house you're ever gonna see. 11,000 square feet over six floors with a private garage that could be double height for all of your Porsches and your Ferraris, private pool, private gym, movie theater, insane kitchen, five bedrooms, 12 bathrooms, 2,000 square feet of outdoor space, right where West Chelsea and the gorgeous gallery district meets the fun and exciting vibe of Meatpacking. Now on the market with the Sirhan team for $18 million. Ready, set, go! <laughs>